I was gonna take some rest, but I kind of realized this is kind of big deal. Nikita Buenov, who's the head developer of the Escape from Tarkov, mentioned EFT API, which is pretty vague. We can't really understand what he's talking about, but basically API, API is like, if there's Tarkov, we have Tarkov game, right? And there's like a third party system we want to utilize for Tarkov game. And API itself is in between for that to work so if you want to manage your stash from your smartphone we need an api to rig it to tarkov itself as far as i understand and what i know of is something like that which is i think nikita has been already announced that we're they're gonna make like a smartphone app which will literally be able to hide down management and those kind of stuff or maybe he might be referring to EFT API talking about third party system. He's gonna go and hunt down more third party systems just like data miners. Um, for example, in Twitch, I mean, logical solution kind of explained it here too. But if you go to Twitch and if you go to Path of Exile. <laughs> Some of you guys might not be interested in this game and not understand what it is, but if you go to Path of Exile, this is a good example. So if you go to some people's like stream and then you can see it here, you can see literally what he's using as a gear in the game. You can't really see it originally, but with the API, they will retro-rig a third party program to check out what in-game he has. For instance, if we were playing Tarkov, if there's someone streaming Tarkov, I guess he can literally just like check out with these kind of screens showing that what what gear he's wearing, what mods he's using, and what level he is. Like people keep asking me if what level my scab is and what skill sets do I have. I always have to like show them one by one or what post effects I have and they can people can just check it through this. So this is an example of an API in a good way of using it. And I really do hope that it's possible, but still, I don't know if he's referring to that open API so we can actually rig our third party system to Tarkov. Or if he's referring that he wants to hunt down the API. So I kind of checked out what people's opinion is, but um, it seems like People are liking it, thinking that they are allowing an open API. But interestingly, there's a bunch of <laughs> unbanned logical solutions. As you s might have seen on the previous video, I just uploaded that logical solutions has been banned for data mining today. Um, if you want to check out the details, check out the video. A lot of people are talking about unbanned logical solutions, unban him. Unban him, unban him, unban him. And there's like a ULI where Nikita literally message logical solutions that ULI. Um, but interestingly, <laughs> now logical solutions is like, I'll be the first to sign up regardless if it's free or not, count me in. I'm like kind of surprised that he's saying that while like a bunch of people below is asking for unbanned logical solutions, unbanned logical solutions and like fighting against for him where he says this here. I was kind of surprised. I don't know. What do you guys think about the API and the situation we're having? Tell me in the comments. And I'll see you in the next video. I hope it's a wipe news next time. Bye bye.